civilized world. Our embassy has been seized and more than 60 American citizens continue to be held as hostages. If we're going to go, then we need to go now. What happened? The six of the hostages went out a back exit. Where are they? The Canadian ambassador's house. We got revolutionary guards going door to door. These people die. They die badly. White House? Who wants the six of them out? What we like for this are bicycles. Deliver the six bikes, provide them with maps. Or you could just send in training wheels and meet them at the border with Gatorade. It's gonna take a miracle to get them out. Fighting man. What are we watching? I got an idea. They're a Canadian film crew for a science fiction movie. I fly into Tehran. We all fly out together as a film crew. I need you to help me make a fake movie. So you want to come to Hollywood and act like a big shot without actually doing anything? Yeah. It'll fit right in. You need a script? Argo. Science fantasy adventure. Moonscape. Mars. Desert. They need an exotic location to shoot. You need a producer. If I'm doing a fake movie, it's going to be a fake hit. You don't have a better bad idea than this? This is the best bad idea we have, sir. By far. You have 72 hours to get them out. They're getting a visitor. Have you gotten people out this way before? No. You're asking us to trust you with our lives. This is what I do, and I've never left anyone behind. They know who they are, and they know they're hiding out. It's over, Tony. If they stay here, they will be taken. Probably not alive. We're responsible for these people. I'm responsible. You really believe your little story is going to make a difference when there's a gun to our heads? I think my little story is the only thing between you and a gun to your head. Far to the east, over ranges and rivers, lies a single, solitary peak. The dwarves are determined to reclaim their homeland. I like visitors as much as the next hobbit. But I do like to know them before they come. Visiting. Mr. Baggins? At your service. Hmm? <laughs> I'm surrounded by dwarves. What are they doing here? Oh, they're quite a merry gathering. <laughs> so, this is the Hobbit. You asked me to find the 14th member of this company, and I have chosen Mr. Baggins. Me? No, 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 no. Hobbits can pass unseen by most if they choose, which gives us a distinct advantage. We will seize this chance to take back Erebor! Yeah. Here, Mr. Bilbo, where are you off to? I'm going on an adventure! Mithrandir, why the halfling? Why Bilbo Baggins? Perhaps it is because I'm afraid. And it gives me courage. So this is your purpose, to enter the mountain. What of it? There are some who would not deem it wise. A dark part has found a way back into the world. Why don't we have a game of riddles? And if it loses, what then? If it loses, precious, then we eat it. <laughs> if Baggins loses, we eat it whole. Fair enough. I will take each and every one of these dwarves over the mightiest army. Loyalty. Honor. A willing heart. I can ask no more than that. Home is now behind you. The world is ahead. Well, that could have been worse.